Can you tell us a bit about the open education project that you worked on that you received the alternative textbook grant for? Absolutely. I've taught a statistics course in the School of Social Work. Um, it's a not just social work students, but it is students with degrees in helping professions. We've seen multiple advances in accessibility uh, mm -hmm. in digital spaces over the past couple of years. So having a course that was about 10 years old for my materials, um, it, was it was past time to upgrade and update things anyway. And I also wanted to find things that would work really well in the learning management system space. Mm -hmm. I moved towards using a lot of tools in there. So I, um, I, I knew about these resources, but I don't think I understood how many available options there were. It was easy. So if I needed to do an update anyway, um, and all these tools were there, it was almost a no-brainer. Um, I found a good text through OpenStax. So I'm getting input and help from the students about what's, what's working, what's not. One of their favorite parts was the textbook. That, they didn't open their physical textbooks, but because it was so easy that they used the digital textbook, right? So it's an open stacks. They're highly regarded. They've been used a lot. And so there's a lot of editing that continually goes into it. And a lot of contributors from all over the, the country, all over the world who contribute to the textbook. Um, so it almost updates in real time which again, it's about ease. This is this pro this has made my life much easier as mm -hmm. a professor mm -hmm. uh, and it helps, it makes it easier for the students as well.